On a même ici dans Dieu, excellent. Et si vous n'avez pas mis ça, vous allez faire des combats, vous allez faire des We will start for invite the presence of God and I would like to call PC Alema Missouri from Bile Chiefdom from the Cambia district for lead me with the Muslim prayer. Aoudzo Bellahi Minashe Itaani Razim Bismillahi Rahman Rahim بحرمات الله لا إله إلا الله وحده كذب لا تعفي السنة ولا نوم له ما في السماوات وما في الأرض من ذل يسفه لله لا بإذنه يعلم ما بين أيديهم وما خلف ولا يتون بشيء من علمه إلا بما ساء وسيء كل شيء السماوات والأرض ولا يخذ يدهم ولا يخذ يدهم ربنا Atina fi dunia Hasanatan Wa fi la akhrati Hasanatan Wa akhina Azabana Arabana La ti yukulibana Bada ihdabtana Wa hablana Inna dunkarunka Inna ka Atal wahab Nasir min Allah Wa fadu mbarim Wa basirlu mumini La hawla Wa la huwata Ila billah Umar bisalli ala umar Fatiha zahra Abu billah الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إذا كان أبو يا كان أستعين بهذين سرادة مستقيم سرادة الذين أمت عليهم خير المقدوب عليهم ولا تولين Thank you very much. We would also like to invite PC Kelly Kumba from Mando Chief Dom, Kailan District for the Christian prayer. <laughs> Let us pray. Almighty and ever living God, we thank you for being here today among us, the leadership of this country. We pray for your blessings and guidance on our newly elected president. Give him wisdom and understanding and empathy for the people that he is supposed to govern. We pray for all blessings on paramount chiefs who are the organic leaders of this country. And we pray especially that there is a good relationship of mutual respect and understanding between our country's leadership in Freetown and the rest of the country. We ask you, O oh Lord, for peace in our nation at this time. We ask for guidance on all who are angry um, to have the blessing of peace in their heart, uh, to know that you, O oh Lord, are the giver of all things, are the appointer of all positions, and therefore, who are we to judge? We ask you also for us leaders to be magnanimous with those who do not like us. We ask you uh, for your special blessings on our First Lady, who we know is going to have a lot of influence, even if behind the scenes, on our new president. We also ask for your blessings and guidance on our vice president, who by statute, also by his relationship with uh, a lot of paramount chiefs here, uh, is, a, is an equally important figure in this land. We pray, O oh Lord, for this country to continue to move higher and higher so that in the end, our people will live in peace and harmony. We offer these discreet prayers to our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass us against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. May the grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us all now and forevermore. Amen. <coughs> Thank you very much. I'd also like now to invite the Honorable Minister for Local Government and Community Affairs for Khan President of Power Manchester. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Thomas Sandu. Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Sierra Leone, the Honorable Vice President of the Republic, Madam First Lady, our dynamic First Lady, the Chairman of our most progressive party, the SNPP, Dr. Prince Alex Harding, colleague ministers, paramount chiefs, and region chiefs. Your Excellency, this is a great day for me, particularly as Minister of Local Government and Community Affairs, where the Council of Paramount Chiefs they phoned me for us say the one for see you after this great event of elections, Mortitia elections nationwide. Your Excellency, I want to inform you say the relationship between the ministry, government, and the Paramount Chiefs it don't progress beyond what I have imagined initially as Minister of Local Government. You will send some, you will send some from the amount of space when you said your Excellency, you don't allow them, the Ministry in particular, for engage with all paramount chiefs. We want for specifically tell you thank you for the amount of movement where you make before and prior to campaign time for visit all the chiefdoms nationwide. Your Excellency, as you are aware, we get 190 paramount chiefs in the nation. And just like where one of the chiefs then talked about earlier, this now the block of governance, the nuclear block of governance. And then people here, all throughout the uh, tenor and where we day, they always don't talk about peace and they don't preach peace and development. And we believe, say, throughout your last five years of tenor, now that you've been unbelieving for career development and every crony of uh, corner in this nation. Today, the council asked me, say, following these elections, the one for Khan congratulate you, and therefore be one of the foremost of people, locally as local leaders, for come for can see you and appreciate you and all your team for the work we don't actually do. On that note, Your Excellency, I want to present you Paramount Chief the Nation. Initially, we want let every Paramount Chief introduce themselves, but we just realize say, if that happened, 190 minutes it will probably take. So because of that, we don't reduce and say, I will humbly ask. Uh, the paramount chiefs and from different districts as I recall so that I would just give up and wave to the president rather than I would do it individually. From the south, from the south, the paramount chiefs of both districts. Let me please stand and just wave to his excellency. Thank you very much. From Bond district, let me just now please stand as well. Thank you, thank you very much. From Moyamba district, let me please stand. Thank you so much. From Pujehum district, Pujehum Wanjama, thank you very much. We cross over to the east. I want to start with the Paramount Chiefs of Kono district. All right, my please. Thank you very much. Thank you. Kerima District. Thank you. Thank you. Kailahun District. 
Ora Tenki. Uh, we move to the northeast, Bombali district. Bombali district, Ora Tenki. Tonkolili district. Tonkolili district. Kwenadugu district. When I do the same thing, I am Falabar, Falabar district. Thank you. With a move to the northwest, Potloko district. Potloko, the near area, Cambia district. Una thank you. Cambia district. Thank you. Karine district. Thank you, Karine. Your Excellency, now the Paramount Chiefs and Nemaya and their representation of Paramount Chiefs, they will do for dinner. They come for can talk to you. I don't know which kind of message they get, but I know send a message of appreciation. On that note, I would really want to kindly ask the chairman of the Council of Paramount Chiefs, whether the Paramount Chief of Sando, for they come forward and come talk to me. Thank you. Your Excellency, sir, the Honorable Vice President, Madam First Lady, Ministers of Government, my colleague, Paramount Chief, then, now all afternoon. We were on there at this job before. We don't pass more than five years. We know, say, inside the Constitution, you get the executive, you get the judiciary, you get the legislation. We come today for meet with the executive and in the national constitution, the institution of chief city under the executive when at section 72. Mr. President, for let's see with our work today, we say self concerned if we will make us see you today so early. That's why you notice uh, we number no reach 190, but I can boastfully say we pass 100. And do a very short ceremony that on behalf of me, Papa, and uh, me, Mama, they were there this afternoon on this Friday. We come for come, congratulate you together with you. Congratulating you and your Vice President. We we'll also want to tell the Vice President and Madam First Lady Boku thank you for the support we they give to you. We know there no reason, Mr. President, for no support you. Past the last five years and the new five years, we will cast that so. Because as you will not say, that the smallest governance unit that the chief does. And one thing when we passionately glad it is, we come in the whole glad it is. This process for the campaign for this election, you don't want to let the chief done any. Yes. Mr. President, for life, now the most difficult thing for do because you know, for use the highest frequency of you brain power for generating the story for life. Oh, yes. But you don't see the good road they want work out now. You don't see the lights we want to get. You don't see the water they want to drink because you don't know it. So no, you can walk you tell for which kind of this. So take you one next time. But may I really see no see now that we need one. But you say self don't go. In fact, you and um, Mr. President and your team and pledging your allegiance and loyalty to you for us have this country together. We once say there are issues where not too rosy in the institution of chieftains. You will not try, but the big user, the pa and mama that say, if we get the statutory function for bringing law and order, now we respect chieftains. Mr. President, the guardian they will need for bring law and order, now we respect chieftains. They no plan that we are on the law reduce considerably. One of the issues that they, Mr. President, are the question of the courts. As we speak here, since 2011, the courts are under the judiciary 
they are not budgeted for, no problem chief, no the answer to the way comfortable with that. We really thank for congratulating you. But I don't want to miss this opportunity while we sit up because I don't know who's staying in the river. <laughs> and he said this only, you know, say, please, sir, if agriculture that the flagship program for you, second time, I don't know, like to you, lawlessness story to you, don't come on at that city there. Would they appeal to you, let me make sure they then cut them, come back to the minister of local government. <laughs> and by default, we need to not discuss this part. And we'll see the necessity during this election for the security gap all together, their respective kingdoms, with the reduction of any police numbers. This part would also appeal to you. We don't see the restored dignity. But no better any police than back a bit. Some of we will chief down there. The police the way they did. But if not to chief the authority and your executive power, it's not the day so man the sharp cut last time money for incompetent. But because of your executive power and the authority we give down there, we the tell Papa go thank you for family and still listen to me. For long God and I am before I take me seat back. The Honorable Musa Tarawali we don't do extremely well. Uh, and why I'm for you. So we we can together now all of the 14 kingdoms outside Frita for whole meetings. Now each of them district then they we have 14 districts for whole meetings now each of them district then they for be able for a show for this second time so all will be part of the winning team. And I will sit on now and I will say this and we wish you well collectively, individually, I think so we are available. Will I'm call me as a group and you will see say as the minister of local government will talk this now. No district not there when not get at least five or six people then per district as a sign of respect. And the argument that the election was not free and fair or power no get choice. Once the law announce you as the winner, we no get choice pass to the life. We are not we are not civil society activists. I know they make this comment for demean civil society. But I know there any parliament chief now where they protest. And today, you second time now, you know we see them placard. We saw the protest because we even really say you know one of we. And I'm going to say there are activists and they right? Where we have sensitive issues where they deal with we, meetings say through you, you beautiful wife or local government minister. You ready for giveaway orders at all times. So to conclude, I assure you of your support and for complete your allegiance to you for a sure now respective children that there will be general peace where collectively it will bring peace to the country for law allowing you to work in peace and unity. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable Chief Chairman. And now I go invites the president for make a response to the chairman. Excellent.